Welcome to War India News R. Digital transformation is an indispensable element in the e-commerce industry. The pandemic has proved to be a source of immense learning for every business, especially for the e-commerce space. The year 2021 witnessed the emergence of digital as a preferred medium for businesses that led to increased adoption of digital for reaching out to the customers. The e-commerce industry, due to its highly volatile nature, has been one of the earliest to recognize the urgency of adopting the new normal. The necessity of employing omni-channel for ensuring sales across channels has paved the way for employing an e-commerce enabler that streamlines all processes such as stock management, warehousing, payment reconciliation and order management. Omni-channel retail or omni-channel commerce is multi-channel approach to sales that focuses on providing seamless customer experience whether the client is shopping online from a mobile device, a laptop or in a brick and mortar store. The year ahead will see digital transformation being recognized as an indispensable element in the e-commerce industry to drive operations, fulfill customer demands and ensure con consumer retention. Many support functions that drive e-commerce operations will come to the forefront. 2021 has been a year of learning as it exposed businesses to unexpected situations with global markets opening, shutting and then reopening again. What emerged as the only tool to cope up with is technology. Businesses have fast adopted the use of technology from their production units to supply chain systems, from marketing to customer loyalty systems. In the midst of all this, smart businesses have also accepted the importance of right price. Technology has also played a key role in price de determination of products and services across sectors at massive scales and high velocities. As pricing majorly contributes towards the growth and success of any company, technologies such as artificial intelligence and machine learning are starting to effectively decide the pricing of products and services. With the advent of speculations around the new COVID variant, technology is bound to be at the forefront in 2022. Reliability of intelligent technologies for decisions related to sensitive areas like pricing will increase because manual errors or any incorrect pricing decisions shall prove to be fatal for businesses in the tech-enabled consumer world. Keeping the current situation in view, companies across retail, travel, entertainment and many more are further going to adopt and evolve technologies that can help in real-time pricing, acknowledging the dynamic market conditions and consumer sentiments. Let's look into today's headlines in VAR India. Sandeep Gupta appointed as Chief Digital and Information Officer of Karen Oil and Gas. Sandeep Gupta has been designated the role of Chief Digital and Information Officer at Karen Oil and Gas. He will report to Prachur Sah, the CEO of Karen Oil and Gas. Sandeep will be leading the digital and technology function for Karen and will work closely with SBU leaders to drive business delivery through accelerating digital transformation journey along with driving innovation, adoption of new age digital practices, cutting edge technical solutions and leveraging business partnerships to help enable SBUs deliver production and fast track growth projects. India is providing a 20-year roadmap to chipmakers, not just dollars, says Ashwini Vaishnav. Union Minister for Electronics and IT Ashwini Vaishnav said that the government will not only facilitate infrastructure support but also fast-track clearances and approvals for some big investments could come as early as in the next four to six months. He further said that while any country can offer the dollars, India is providing a 20-year roadmap to companies. Joker malware is found to be downloaded 5 lakh times from Google Play Store app. Joker has been one of the most prevalent forms of malware to appear on the Android store and it's just been found hiding in another app, one that was downloaded 5 lakh times. It made the users sign up to premium services without their knowledge. Researchers often identify mobile applications available on the Google Play Store infected with Joker malware. The latest of them is Color Message. Joker can be difficult to be detected as it uses very little code and conceals it thoroughly. ATOS acquires CloudReach 
ATOS has acquired CloudReach, a leading multi-cloud services company specializing in cloud application development and cloud migration. The company employs more than 600 highly skilled employees and is headquartered in London. Through this acquisition, CloudReach's strengths in consulting, transforming and building digital solutions for customers using cloud-based applications, data and analytics and machine learning are embedded in hybrid and multi-cloud platforms with ATOS's proven leadership in hybrid cloud. SAP HANA, Application Modernization, Digital Workplace, Edge Computing, Cybersecurity and IoT. Thoma Bravo brought bottom line for $2.6 billion. Bottom Line Technologies, a leading provider of financial technology that makes complex business payments simple, smart and secure, has entered into an agreement to be acquired by Thoma Bravo, a leading software investment firm in an all-cash transaction that values Bottom Line at approximately $2.6 billion. The transaction will allow Bottom Line to benefit from the operating capabilities, capital resources and sector expertise of one of the most experienced and successful software and financial technology investors. That's all for now. Please like, share, comment and subscribe to War India News Magazine. You can download the War India app from Google Play Store and Apple App Store for the latest news and updates. Stay tuned. Thank you.